This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. It's a little light, but we're gonna I'm gonna keep you guys up to date as the day goes on with small little tidbits of news. Okay, so first off, we got little baby. He says, Oh no, nah, it's more than 200 an occasion now. That was that song was old. Okay. <laughs> little babies out here getting money. Uh and I I just hope he doesn't get too when you get overly confident, sometimes you fall off a little bit and I hope he doesn't do that. I hope he just continues proving himself because I've seen rappers just get too confident and they kind of like fall back a little bit and things get weird. Um, especially there's a lot of things going on at QC right now. So I hope he keeps that pressure on. Then we got, so Takashi Akon, we talked about that yesterday. Well, what's funny is Takashi actually gets off of house arrest today um, you know, Meek Mill and Snoop Dogg will probably have a lot to say about that. But he gets off a of house arrest. He's going to be out. Uh, we don't know what the first thing he's going to do. He's been doing videos from his house, making millions of dollars from his living room. So now, uh, what is he going to do? Is he going to go to? Is he going to actually go to New York or something, or is he going to just do some videos around the country? I don't know what he's going to do. But he's definitely back on Instagram. He's back. I think he already went to uh, do all the child support stuff with his baby mom and everything. I don't know. Uh, Logic. Let's revisit this. So Logic, I saw the interview he did with Paul Rosenberg, who was Paul Rosenberg was like, oh, oh, oh. no, no, I'm serious. Peter Rosenberg. Go, 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 go. Logic, you're the best. Your voice is amazing. Your point of view is amazing. You're amazing. Logic's a great rapper. Okay. Um, but there's a lot of great rappers out there. He's retiring because he's sick of being cr uh, criticized on the internet. Now, hey, people have issues. Uh, they're unbalanced. And some people can't take the criticism. I get it. But to cr cry like a baby about it. Come on. I'm, si I'm sick of the crybabies. The people uh, putting their own problems off on other people. He blamed Joe Budden for his words that make him want to take his own life. I mean, come on, bro, stop. Um, you can't blame one person in their opinion. It's called, like we talked about this last night and I'll talk about it again. When you put your art out there, it gets judged, it gets critiqued. And some people don't like you and you gotta have thick skin, okay? Um, you know, it is what it is, man, but logic is being a baby and I hate all artists that are babies about stuff like that. About hey, people are so mean. You know, it's like, come on, stop. Just do something else then. Do something else. Be behind the scenes. Jeez, I'm so sick of those people. Um, so TikTok might be being uh, get banned by the president. Um, now, listen. TikTok is a great platform for creators. The problem is, is that it and some other apps, okay? It we, When you have an app that's owned by another country, like, Ch you know, China, okay? So they might be allegedly gathering data when the app is off. Uh, another app that does this, allegedly, is the DJI app for a drone. I have it. Uh, supposedly, this is what they say in news reports and New York Times and everything. They say that it's gathering data and location data. Data is worth a lot of money. Also, if you can track U.S. people of their habits of where they go, where when you know, like think about it. a lot of apps do this. Okay, Google does this, Apple does this. How do you think they know where traffic is? Where? how many people are in a store at a given time you know when it says traffic at this store usually light around this time it's because they get data of people going to the store they're you they're tracking your location behind the scenes there's actually if you go deep into the settings of apple iphone it'll it's tracking your whereabouts all day like that's a good way to catch your girl lying to you <laughs> if you the, i forget the setting look it up on google if you go deep into the setting it, it tracks where you were at each point during the day. Crazy, right? Um, you'd have to turn off location finder, and then you can't use any apps because they want to know your location all the time. Um, anyways, TikTok should, if it's U.S. owned, I guess we could trust it, but you can't really trust another country with all that kind of data. You know, they could be listening, a bunch of stuff. And um, 
you know, I think it just needs to be reformed. You know, Microsoft might buy it. Um, that'll be big if Microsoft buys it. But uh, Microsoft isn't that great at creating uh, social media platforms. You know, they have the Microsoft. I'm sorry, they have the Xbox. I mean, that's different. That's video games. They had Microsoft 95 and all that stuff, but they failed with everything else, the Surface, everything else. Microsoft is more of a behind the scenes company than a company that's in the forefront now. They're big into cloud services and I think Zoom, they own Zoom. Um, you know, they're into stuff like that. They're more business oriented. I don't, I don't, I think the best move would have been maybe in, you know, Facebook bought TikTok you know, uh, or something like that, if you want to keep the platform going. Um, but they definitely want to regulate it because there's definitely some hidden things in there that are a little bit spooky. Uh, the the DJ, DJI app does the same thing. It's a Chinese company too. A lot of spooky things happening out here in the world today. Anyways, tell me what you guys think about TikTok. I mean, I think it should still stay around. I mean, a lot of people have created... Um, a following on there and I don't think it should go away but I never really downloaded it or anything but I, I, I see it's kind of like Vine Vine and for Twitter I don't know why Vine didn't really take off it took off for like a year and then it was over um, TikTok is like the new Vine in a way you know it, it works similar to Vine uh, this is Jordan Tower with JT News I will check you guys on the next one peace